Hello, YouTube. How we doing today? What's going on, everybody? Hello, and welcome back to Samurai Saturday. We're going to play some Ghost of Tsushima tonight. How you feel about that? All right. So, let me say hi to the chat. Who we got with us? Aw, uh -huh, look at this bad motherfucker. Jeremy McGee, first one in the chat. Hello, sir. Miss Dandy Denny. Hello, ma'am. How are you? James Guan. What is up? Chrissy Cuppy Cake. Hello, Missy Chrissy. How are you, ma'am? All right. Hey, good to see everybody. How are y'all doing tonight? You want to hang out, play some video games? Let's do it. Now, if I could just remember how to exit photo mode, we would be doing okay. There we go. <laughs> I spend so much time in photo mode, I forgot how to exit photo mode. <laughs> okay, so I wasn't really doing anything spectacularly interesting. Uh, I was, pl I got to play for, oh, maybe an hour and a half or so, uh, just trying to warm up a bit for tonight's stream. Uh, and so I was just kind of clearing some of these question marks off of the map that I had missed earlier. Uh, and... Um, running around with the Traveler attire, trying to burn off more of the fog of war from the map. Uh, I don't really know what I want to do next. Mm, let's see. Who else? Oh, I see new names popping in. Headhunter Telesto. What's up, Hunter? How you doing, man? Knights of Finland is with us. I know what you're thinking. Did he fire six shots for only five? <laughs> kind of lost track myself. Yeah. Okay. Well... Days Gone Podcast. Hello, Miss Claire. What's going on? Jay, what is up with it, man? How are you? Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and finish working on these for a minute. We can do some story missions here in a minute. I would like to push forward with the story some more tonight. I'll just wrap up what I was working on. Oh, assholes. Let's go get them. Wait, 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 wait. Wrong outfit. Um. Yeah, there we go. That's the one. There's my bad motherfucker. Uh, hang on, I'm getting messages here. Oh, okay. Quasimodo is saying he will be late for tonight's stream. No worries, mate. <laughs> Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. There's my kick-ass armor. Let's go kick some ass, shall we? Or hey. get our asses kicked trying. Whatever happens first, you know. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. I like his shield. That shield looks badass. Didn't do him much good, but it still looks cool. Still hollering over there? I thought I heard somebody else yelling over there. What I thought, fool. Wait, how far are we going? I'm, oh, yeah, we call it. We are calling the horse. Oops, sorry. Deer crossing. A couple years ago, that would have been a terrible idea. Oh, wait, it still is. Did I miss my chance to do a standoff? No, I want to do a standoff. Please let me do a standoff. Come and fight. Thank you. Okay, let's try again. 
Yeah. Got your bitch ass, didn't I? I love that death gurgle. That was fucking brutal. Wow. Yeah, you thought you were bad. What's up, little fella? I bet you're glad this isn't Horizon Zero Dawn. <laughs> what does the fox say? The fox says, please don't shoot me with an arrow for my skin and meat. Oh wait, not Horizon Zero Dawn. Never mind. up with the standoff thing not working. That's twice. Yes, please, standoff. Thank so you. <laughs> Fox says, for fuck's sake, leave me alone. What did you call me? Here we go. This is it right here. Gotcha. <laughs> I love how the Falcon is just like sitting still on his shoulder through that animation. <laughs> Look at their feet. Helps with standoffs. Yeah, thank you, XT, XY Gaming. Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, I had noticed that. <clears throat> And that does work. I appreciate that tip. What bothers me sometimes is like when they're standing in like, let's say we're in tall grass or something and you can't see their feet. That always trips me up, so to speak. And uh, I think uh, Hunter was telling us recently that it also helps to watch their hips, like the swordsmen specifically, like uh, with the, the Ronin Samurai. Uh, it helps to watch their hips to see when they're going to move, which makes sense. Hips don't lie. <laughs> this is true in many cases. This is true. Body language. Can we go? We can't go that way, can we? Man, I would fucking kill for a mini map. I really would. Where is this golden bird taking me? Where are you taking me, bird? Hello? No, I don't want to jump over the cliff. Why is the wind telling me to jump off a cliff? Guiding wind says you should throw yourself off a cliff. Nobody likes you. going bird oh over here okay cool do I have to get off the horse for something I really don't want anyway of course I do yay more cosmetics neat big care okay and eh, that's too far I don't want to run that far all right let's go to some story missions Ooh, or we could clear Mongol camps. That's, yeah, yes, 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 we can do that. Let's go clear some Mongol camps. This is fairly close, right? <laughs> Chrissy says, well, I mean, if it's what the wind says, you know, don't jump into the abyss. Wait, but I, oh, okay. I guess. All right, fine. I won't, I won't throw myself off the cliff. <laughs> Aren't you supposed to stare into the abyss first? <laughs> Wait. 
More assholes. Let's go get them. Oh, that's critters. What kind of critter did I just hear? I know I heard a critter. Sounded like a bear, I thought. Yep, bear. Where's he at? Oh, okay, I see. They're fighting him up here. You can tell the enemies are more badass in this area. Because earlier in the game, if you found enemies fighting a bear, the bear would kill them. Now, find enemies fighting a bear, the bear is dead. Yeah, yeah. That is very satisfying when you manage to pull it off right. Look at the fucking blood on the snow. Wicked. Now, wait a minute. How is he still alive after that? Well, I don't need to heal up. So let's get him. Yeah. Bear. Do what? Jeremy McGee and... I got lost. Got lost in all your past mistakes. I mean, come on, Rex. Follow the rules. I don't like rules. You know, I'm, I'm actually... I'm not a big fan of rules, you know? <laughs> in Soviet Russia, bear crush you. <laughs> hey. What's up, Richie? Yeah. Next. Um, give me two more. Last one. There we go. Fuck, look at that shit. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm digging this snow area with the blood all over the snow. That's... It's kind of fucked up, but I like it. Oh, even the bird died. I didn't kill the bird, did I? I didn't mean to kill the bird. Just wanted to kill the assholes. Yeah, thanks, Hunter. Yeah, I. Of course, now that we've said something, I'm going to start fucking them up. <laughs> That's how this works. Oh, and a prisoner. To rescue. Hold still. Finally. Thank you, my lord. Be careful up there. My lord, this is for you. Oh, hey, I have skill points. I should probably do something with those. I don't want people to start taking bets on how many I'm going to end up with. Shit, I've got most of the skills, don't I? I, I? This one didn't seem really useful to me. I don't really see myself jumping off the horse to attack very often. I'll generally just get off the horse and do a standoff, but I mean, I guess it's kind of cool. If you have it, you might as well have it or whatever. Am I doing the DLC? I would love to. Yes, actually. Uh, I don't know that I'll cover it on this uh, live stream series, uh, but yes, I actually would like to. Uh, I would like. I definitely plan to play the expansion. Yes. I don't know that I will be covering it in the live stream. We'll just have to see how it goes. Okay. Are are any of these actually worth a damn? Uh, increased health would be cool. Uh, and which one is this? Increased resolve? Okay. Uh, yeah, the charms, I could live without them. Uh, I mean, I know they have their uses, but I'm not, like, super excited about them or anything. These, yeah, whatever. Oh, definitely not. Um, okay. Um, yeah, more health. Why not? So what this does is you can now set the guiding wind. I, I don't understand what this does, actually. Does this show me where they are? What does that do? Hunter, what does that skill actually do? The, uh... The exploration skill... To, uh... 
how does this actually work? What do I do with this? <laughs> you steal your steal my controller and do it yourself? Uh uh. Hands off, young lady. I don't think so. Right, I understand. I mean, okay, Jay, does it, just like if you get near one, does the wind kick up and point you in that direction? Or do I have to, like, find it on my map? Or, I mean, yeah, I mean, I understand how the guiding wind works, is what do I actually do with this skill? It will lead you to the hot springs to increase your health. Okay, if you select that. Oh, so, wait, is it, is it not a passive? Is it a skill that you have to activate somehow? How do you activate it? If you select it, it'll point you directly towards it. You select it. Okay, how do I select it? How how is that skill actually used? Select things for the guiding wind to lead you to on, on the map. Right, but if I haven't... Okay, I guess what I'm not understanding is if, if, I, if I don't already have that hot spring on my map, how do I select it on the map to go find it? That's what I'm not understanding. I don't know what this skill actually does or how it is used. In the menu... Okay. Well, that would be cool. Hmm. It's in the skills menu. Techniques. Hmm. Here we are. Kill General Bartool. That's it. You have arrived at your destination. Mr. Pilon, what's going on, man? Yeah, how are you? Ah, okay, okay. So Chrissy is saying hit the right button on the D-pad and it will allow you to select your guiding wind. Chrissy Cuppy Cake to the rescue. Thank you, dear. That's what I was missing. It's like, how is the skill actually activated? And I see it now down there uh, at the lower left corner of the map where it says guiding wind target. Uh, and now you can select which ones. Okay, sweet. Thank you. Uh, thanks, everybody. That did help me figure it out. Cool. Much, much, much appreciated. Because I, I, I understood that, you know, the the healing springs are locations that you find to increase your health. And, and I understand that the guiding wind will lead you to things if you have it selected on your map. But I didn't understand how to select healing springs that you haven't already found. So you go to the map here and use the uh, guiding wind inter interface to select what you want your target to be. Cool. Oh, did you say it also, Hunter? Uh, I missed it, man. Uh, you know how the chat's usually hopping around here. I look away and it's already scrolled up two pages. <laughs> At the same time. <laughs> nice. All right. Thanks. I appreciate you guys. Thank you, Hunter. Thank you, Chrissy. That does help. That was exactly what I needed to know. Thank you. Now, oh, hello. Is there a... <laughs> oh, we're going to die. Is there a way for me to get a little bit closer to the camp? Like, but still maintain my height advantage here? Because I do like the idea of, uh, you know, taking them from an elevated position. But I would like to get a little bit closer. I wonder if the... Will the sniper bow get them from up here? WD, what's up, man? Hmm. Yeah, I, 
probably could. Oh. I don't want to aggro the whole camp, though, before I even get started. Oh, I do see a way in. Maybe? Can I get down over there? <laughs> the whiskey has slowed my reading rate. <laughs> no, actually, I'm just drinking tea tonight. Yeah, just drinking tea. Nothing interesting. I did see a way down. Where's the steps that I saw? Right there. Okay. I see it now. That's what I was looking for. Uh, Long Island iced tea? <laughs> nope, just tea. Just regular old English breakfast tea. guys in this camp are pretty formidable. Be ready for a fight. Okay, thank you. I'm glad I'm going in kind of slow and careful. Uh, going in slow and easy this time. Knights of Finland Rex, who are you? And what have you done with the real one? <laughs> the brown drink has no booze in it. What gives, Rex? <laughs> uh, you know, I'm just taking it easy. I don't drink every night. I mean, most nights, but not every night. In stealth. Take a look at the chat. Remember to use ghost stance. Ah, ghost stance. That's a good one, Jay. Thank you. I do forget that a lot. The it's so funny. Like this character is so powerful. If you can just get the timing of like the parries and remember to throw a kunai every now and then, you're going to be okay. You know. And so I I tend to forget some of the more powerful abilities that he has because he has a lot of badass abilities. <laughs> Days Gone Podcast says, Well, Knights of Finland, I kidnapped the real Rex. He's in my dungeon. I mean, basement. Totally meant basement. <laughs> I will have to duel the general. Okay. Uh, what? Oh, yeah, Jay, be sure to tell him that every time he gets hit anyway. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> it happens. Uh, use your ghost stance for some easy savage kills. Okay. Is it kidnapping if you went willingly? <laughs> I decline to comment. Yeah. Uh, this area is part of the side mission to acquire the Mongol commander armor. Okay. Is that armor any good? I haven't heard anything about that one yet. He's in your dung? <laughs> no, sir. We do not play that way. <laughs> yeah. Use throwables also. That is also a good one. Yeah. Okay. All right. So now ghost stance is click both analog sticks. Okay. I will uh, try to remember that. I'm probably going to fuck it up, but I'll try to remember. I'll try to make y'all proud. Oh, my God. I'm going to die. <laughs> Already? Really? Oh, I, okay. See, I... Was that dude there the whole time? Gotcha. Uh, sorry. This one. Can I get this guy? He's going to turn around, isn't he? He's definitely going to turn around. Don't turn around. Don't you fucking do it. Don't you fucking do it. That's what I call. Okay, who's next? Alright. I'm, I'm 
hiding in the grass. Let me check the chat. <laughs> the stocks are in the attic. You thought the stocks were in the attic? Well, I mean, they are, but the basement's just a different vibe, you know. <laughs> Richie, I recall people telling you this. What, use throwables? Yes, definitely. I do forget the throwables a lot. Uh, it's definitely good. It's just a lot of work to get them all together. Oh, and you have to get it. Uh, made by some, Wait, what are we talking about? Are we still talking about stocks and dungeons? Uh, it's like I said last week, barring mythics and ghost weapons, perfect parry is the single most powerful attack in Jen's arsenal. If you master it, you will be lethal. I agree. I mean, shit, really, if you're good at that, what else do you need? Uh, maybe perfect dodge for those attacks that can't be parried, but, you know. <laughs> Wait, why y'all keeping me on my toes, man? Light and friendly... In the attic, heavy stuff in the basement. Oh my goodness, you, you man, you girls are out of control. What, you, I, uh, y'all scare me. Shit. <laughs> if you believe that, I'll tell you another lie. Days gone podcast. I would personally tie him to a tree in the middle of nowhere and leave him there. Oops, shared my plan. <laughs> I do not consent to that. I do not consent to that. <laughs> hey, cats with us. Catherine Jones, what's going on, Miss Kitty Cat? How you doing, girl? <laughs> Y'all are wild. Okay, what direction are they facing? Uh, this way, apparently. Shit. I was kind of hoping I could get in close enough for maybe a chain assassination on them. Maybe? That's never going to happen, though, is it? Nope. Not ever. Okay, shit. Alright, what do I do with these guys? They're being dicks. Oh, or these guys. Hey, is that the general right there? That's him, isn't it? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, buddy. You got to go. Bye! Bye! <laughs> Love it. Come here, asshole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Uh oh. Time to go. Bye. <laughs> oh, I should have assassinated him. Dang it. I didn't realize I could until it was nearly. Until it was actually too late. What did, you, did he say? Bullshit? He said something bullshit. Okay, let me check the chat. That's not... Well, that was not the general? Huh, okay. You you have to actually duel this general. Okay, that's what Richie... Or, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I said that wrong. It's what Hunter was saying earlier. You do have to duel that general. Okay. It did say slaughter. That's why I thought it was one of the... Uh, that's why I thought it was the uh, general. Yeah, because it gave me the option to slaughter him at the beginning of the encounter. Duel General after finishing the objectives. Gotcha. Okay. And... Mm -mm. That was just the General's intern. <laughs> Damn it, Jeff. <laughs> Stay out of the way while the grown-ups are talking, Jeff. Shit. Maybe... Smoke bombs? I have smoke bombs, right? It's these guys, right? Okay, so maybe if I bust up in here and pop a smoke bomb? Ah, I just lost ghost stance. How the fuck do you use... Okay. I'm gonna do it anyway just to piss you guys off. What the fuck was that, dude? Damn them dogs got some junk. 
like, no, you don't. Not today, asshole. <laughs> Motherfucker. Oh, shit. Oh, here we go. Uh, another smoke bomb? Oh, I should have done the chain assassinate, man. I didn't see the option until it was too late. Having too much fun with that. Alright, now it's... How about some kunai? And some of these. Who's next? What else you got, fellas? Oh, y'all still just standing around? Alright, cool. Oh, sir. Hey, get out of there. Boy, what are you doing? Alright, here we go. Now. There we go. That's better. Holy fucking shit. Okay, let's try not to fuck up Ghost Dance again. <laughs> and now we'll take a moment to catch up with the chat. Hey, chat, what's going on? <laughs> okay. Uh, I have. Damn, I missed quite a bit. Okay, uh, uh, General's intern. It's only days away from earning his college credit. Fuck that guy. That's what he gets for fucking with me. <laughs> yep, it was Jeff. Uh, okay, if you assassinate Mongol leaders, your ghost stance meter will be filled immediately, making ghost stance immediately usable. Okay, nice. <laughs> You just got in trouble for yelling, you ho. <laughs> hey, who are you calling a ho? <laughs> I'll have you know I'm a perfectly respectable gentleman. I ain't no ho. <laughs> now they're empty nesters. <laughs> Damn, girl. Uh, I've been listening to some Mongolian heavy metal. Okay, <laughs> right on. <laughs> that sounds cool. Don't let him kill the prisoner. There's a prisoner? Fuck, I didn't even know there was a prisoner. Uh-oh. The Who? I've heard of those guys, yeah. Uh, I see them pop up in my YouTube every now and then. <laughs> yeah, Richie, they, they could have bought a new basement with that money. Mongols start backing away because they're afraid if you get up in... Yes, get up in their face for quick major damage. Yeah, sometimes I just, like, I don't register right then. Ooh, opening for an attack. You know, I'm, I'm like, looking at whatever stuff. But, yes, that, that is a good a good tip. Thank you. Uh, hell yeah, they better be scared, right? Oh, Days Gone Podcast removed a retracted a message. What 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 did I miss? Jeff was the soul of the camp. <laughs> Yeah, they probably don't care for this game much, actually. Okay, now what? Oh, what was there a was there a hostage in there that got killed? Tell me there wasn't. Falcons. There was falcons. In, okay, did I let the falcon go, or did the falcon get killed, or something? Please tell me the falcon didn't get killed. Oh, she dropped my OnlyFans link. Well, why'd you retract it then? Put that shit back in there. I don't really have an OnlyFans. Use that moment of hesitation to plan your next move. Yeah. Yeah, agreed. Absolutely. It's all about mastering the game and learning to take advantage of those little moments. I let it go? Okay, it was by accident. I didn't mean to. Press F for Jeff. <laughs> okay, what else we got? Any other good shit up here? Missing the big books. Oh, <laughs> for OnlyFans, yeah. <laughs> yeah, maybe someday. Fuck. 
fuck your door. <laughs> Can you hide in this like one piece of grass? I'm hiding. <laughs> I am hidden. I am stealth. <laughs> over here. I'd kind of like to ruin his day first. Sir, would you stand still, please? Yeah, yeah. Days Gone Podcast. Gotta go! Period of mourning for Jeff. Also packing. Also playing Sniper Hey! You're gonna go play Snipe Sniper Elite instead of watching my stream? I'm teasing. I know you'll be doing both. Later, hon. Bye. Uh, what, what did that door do to you, Rex? <laughs> oh, shit. What did... Oh. <laughs> James, yeah. How did I get one letter wrong? <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> well, I mean, they are side by side, right? What have you been drinking tonight? <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. Let's see. What, do we have here? what else do we have? All right, we got one more asshole over there. One more there. Three down there. Hmm. All right, let's go get them. I mean, I'm trying to play this quiet. I guess I should actually be. Oh, hello. I should actually be using like some stealth armor. Oh, really? You're gonna you're gonna go up there? Okay, fine. That's right. No, 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 no. Put that fucking horn down, sir. I don't know what you thought you were going to do with that horn. What is this dude doing? How did you stab him through his helmet? That was kind of weird. Okay, what else is going on in the chat? Man, you folks are out of control tonight. <laughs> yeah, you had one job, man. <laughs> Hit the letter F. Uh, Knights of Finland, you're playing Minecraft. You have a World War One map that you're working on? Well, that's, that's fucking awesome, dude. Yeah, Dandy, yes. Get the packing done, and then there's the unpacking. But she'll have a helper for that part. <laughs> no, st Are you saying no stealth or no stealth? Which one is it? Oh, James, you were packing. Also packing today it was a bit sad when you packed. Oh, you packed up your PlayStation. Oh, so you must be pretty close to your move date. Hmm. <laughs> Chrissy says, yeah, really, we're still unpacking. <laughs> Combo breaker. <laughs> Going on six months, still not fully unpacked yet. <laughs> Only here temporarily. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. It doesn't make much sense to fully unpack if you know it's a temporary situation. <laughs> Why do you have to say unpacking so sultry like that? Well, I mean, that's just, that, this is actually how I talk. Like, for those of you that know me, this is actually my voice. Uh, hang on a sec, I'm getting messages. One moment. All right. <clears throat> Ref refuse to pack the TV because you want to be able to tune into the stream. Right on. Thanks, man. Uh, lots to unpack there, Rex. <laughs> Sometimes, yeah. Using auto-tune. <laughs> Interestingly enough, actually, I have hardware here to uh, edit the microphone audio as it goes through. And I'm not using it right now because I bought the wrong kind of fucking interface. 
because I actually really don't know anything about doing this kind of shit. I don't have any experience with like audio processing or anything like that. So it, it's all new to me. I'm, I'm literally learning every bit of it from the ground up. We wound up buying the wrong hardware. But I do have hardware that uh, will edit the microphone audio as it goes live. Ah, uh, let's see. You get make fun you get made fun of for your voice? Yeah. And you mentioned that you do a little bit of uh voice acting, uh voiceovers and stuff like that. That's cool. <laughs> Calm down, Dandy Danny. Uh the unpacking not being able to find a thing, even though you put labels on everything, right? Every box is labeled. Still can't find shit. <laughs> Uh, Rex sings the Christmas classics. <laughs> Quasimoto, there he is. Better late than never, sir. What's going on? Yeah, you only realize how much shit you've accumulated when you try to move. Oh, fuck, now we're talking about Rex's hardware. No, man, I meant like streaming equipment. <laughs> oh, wait. Uh, Quasimoto saying he always has a good time playing with Jeremy? Wait, wait a minute. Oh, video games. Yeah, you guys play video games together, don't you? Neat. Cut Rex some slack because now that I'm using my headset and people are hearing my voice, <laughs> you're trying hard to be confident with it. Yeah, it does. It's it's an adjustment, isn't it? It is an adjustment. Just putting your voice out there and trying to be confident with it. Yeah. Best advice? Just be yourself. Don't uh, don't be overly concerned about other people's opinions, unless it's somebody you actually give a shit about, and they'll love you. Anyway. Ah. Hmm. Now, how do I get to this rat bastard? Can I pop the door open and rush in there and stab him? <laughs> Asshole. Okay. Looks like only one up there by himself. Okay. Oh, one right there looking right at me. Is that an enemy? It is an enemy, isn't it? Ooh, I don't know if I can make that headshot from like that. Oh, no, 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 no. No, see, now you're gonna make me have to make a headshot. No, sir. Not today. Okay, here we go. Inside. Oh, we can do one of these. Gotcha. I thought I was going to get to stab him through the door, but oh well. Oh well. At least we got the stealth kill. Okay, let me catch up with the chat. Oh, hey, check this shit out. Well, I turned my head to look at the chat, and the first thing I see, somebody that was never there. <laughs> Thank you, brother. I appreciate you, man. I get the feeling you don't want us to make a big deal out of that, so I'm not going to gush, but thank you, for real. <laughs> Throw a wind chime outside the door to do a shoji, okay. Yeah, I need to be using those wind chimes more. I am actually trying to get the hang of stealth. Um, I just, yeah, it's, you know, it's just not my thing. It's really not. I can when I set my mind to it, but it's it's just not my thing. It's not my preferred play style. A ninja just super chatted. Yeah, no idea who he is, though. <laughs> Never saw him. <laughs> Okay, uh, yeah, man. 
And I don't need kunai right now. Sir, can I get you to open that door, please? Okay, who's next? This is a really big camp. I must be near... Ah, I am near one of the birds. Okay, cool. Oh, I'm near a Sashimono banner. Oh, and another bird up there. How did I miss that one? Okay, cool. No, I don't really want to challenge remaining enemies just yet. See, Chrissy says, if you take it a little slower, you can usually pop them through the door. Okay. And Quasi says, the poison charm with wind chimes is maliciously sadistic fun. Well, that does sound like a good time. Uh, let's see. Cat says, Rex, sneak mode activation on. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. <laughs> Do not turn around. <laughs> Quasi, the criminal runs deep in you. <laughs> I got a peewee word of the day reaction every time somebody says camp. What? Be free, my feathered friends. Yeah, Hunter, I agree, man. Uh, that shit, that's one of the things I love about Days Gone. Like, if you look at, <clears throat> if you look at my playstyle in Days Gone, and you look at Borislav twenty four seven in Days Gone, and you look at Days Gone podcast in Days Gone. You, you have three very, very different play styles, but all three are really good at the game and come up with really cool shit to do in the game. And, uh, you know, I mean, it's, it blows me away how, you know, three different people, three totally different play styles, uh, and all equally effective, just different. And really, you know, I'm going to go ahead and say it. I think that says a lot about people in general, man. You know, just different no better no worse just different so there's your ex wisdom for the day <clears throat> also need to kill three enemies with ghost dance for bonus oh no where does that tell you that i don't remember seeing that anywhere uh ghost dance for bonus um, oh <laughs> i try to be a nice guy but i actually am not a nice guy is that why we get along quasimodo I try really hard to be a nice guy, but I'm actually not a nice man. <laughs> Wish you could use a rifle, right? <laughs> Did you see his live feed? <gasps> He's already put up the notice? Oh, right on. Right on. Okay, cool. I'll, I'll have to take a look at that. I haven't been on his community page yet. Oh, yeah, Chrissy, you were showing me your Days Gone notes from when you were first playing. <laughs> All your adorable little nerd notes. <laughs> uh, Knights of Finland, Rex. I have some videos of me playing Days Gone, but it's in Norwegian. Well, I mean, it's the gameplay that matters. Uh, do you? Where would we find your YouTube channel? Is it under your current username, Knights of Finland, or uh, is it posted under a different account or something? He'll put a link to it in the chat, man. I don't mind. <laughs> Quasimodo, good point, you know. I think so, Rex. We recognize who we are and strive to be a better person. Yes, sir. That's what it's all about, right? Okay. Oh, and there's the Sashimono banner. Down. Can, I, can I make that? I can make that, can't I? Oh, one way to find out. <laughs> Take the leap. See what happens. I actually didn't mean to do that. I was going to just open it this time. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, it's on the other side of the... Fuck it, we'll crash this one too. I ain't got to replace that door. I see a few more over there. One more Sashimono banner over there. Wasn't there another eagle nearby? Hmm. 
catch up with the chat. <clears throat> oh, damn, it has rolled on a bit. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, Jay, you take video game notes too when you were a kid? Yeah, hell, I still do. <laughs> Oh, Richie, I recall dealing with the train horde for the first time. Yeah, man. Uh, that's That was the first horde I ever took on. That was the first horde that I ever killed. Oh, Finn says hi. Hey, Finn, what's going on, buddy? <laughs> Just dying a lot is all I remember. Yeah, right. Which game has the most intricate notes? Probably... Dragon Age Inquisition. Hulk smash. <laughs> 80s action quip, so... <laughs> yeah, sorry, man. That's not where my skill set is. <laughs> ah, it was Dragon Age Inquisition. I guessed it. <laughs> oh, Hunter, uh, Death Train Horde was your first Horde kill as well? I think it really is for a lot of people. I know for me personally, it's one that I just, I just got sick of running from them, you know? Because it's like, there are so many missions that have you go through that intersection there, you know, taking that highway there. Um, and, you know, I, you do like a dozen missions there, and every time it's like, oh, fuck, run! And I just got tired of running, you know, and I had discovered a few of the hidden loot locations. So I had some grenades and some bombs and, you know, tractors and stuff like that. The stuff you get from those hidden loot locations. And um, I was like, you know what? You fuckers are mine. I'm tired of running. Let's do this. And yes, I did die a couple times, but it only took me a couple of tries. And I was like, ah, I get it. Don't just piss off the horde and run wherever they chase you. Lead them where you want them to be. That's how you do it. Put them where you want them. So you throw the attractor by the big ass truck, blow up the fucking truck, done deal, right? And the method that I came up with that first time is pretty, pretty fucking close to how I still do it now. Set a few traps, lead them into the traps, go on about your day. Slice to see. Oh, God. That's actually a good one <laughs> for this game. That's actually pretty good. Uh, oh, oh, Finn says, Rex needs to be careful because he's going to fall down and need a boo-boo band-aid. <laughs> Train horde, palm to head, shakes head in shame. So bad. Oh, oh, no, your hubby was laughing at you while you were dying. <laughs> <laughs> That's terrible. Funny as shit, but terrible. <laughs> oh, man. Rex needs so many boo-boo band-aids. Right? Sometimes. Rex, tractors? Oh, <laughs> did I say tractors or did I say a tractor? <laughs> I, I guess I did say a tractor. <laughs> Smart ass. All right, what else do we have here? So this guy, it looks like he's in... No, he is just outside of the tent. He's over there by himself. Can I... Let's do this. Hey, buddy. Bye. Slice to meet you. <laughs> Love it. Okay, we'll come around and get this guy from behind. Do so love to take them from behind. What else do we have? Who's next? Hey, buddy. Really? It's not gonna let me do the kill. It's not gonna give me the option to it. There it is. Gotcha. <laughs> the interns can't stay alive for shit around here. <laughs> okay. Was that the last of them? So there are more objectives, though. There's a Sashimono banner. Uh, let's uh, recover one more banner. Oh, and uh, <clears throat> kill enemies with ghost dance. <laughs> Whoops. Whoopsie. That's pretty much everybody, isn't it? 
Okay, so where is the uh, the general here? Oh, there's one more. That's my next objective over there, isn't it? Ooh. Sir, I'm gonna need you to not fall down and crack your knees. Thank you. Oh, no, oh, that's not a bird. That's a bomb. Time to go. Have a knife day. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, hang on. Uh, Hunter says, I just missed it. Shit. Um, dun, dun, dun. Here's, okay, I was doing that mission where you have to gather the lavender for Boozer, yeah. And you had enough of them chasing you, so you took, oh, okay, right on. Took a few tries, yeah, right on. A tractor? Where? I'll go. Oh, I'm gonna fucking die, aren't I? Okay. <clears throat> Nice sword. I want one. Mine's better, though. Hey, that's no fair. Okay, I'm gonna die. There we go. Dude, he interrupted my fucking slash. This guy's a badass. I don't like him. I, I think I'd like to kill him now, actually. He's Wow. This looks like a piece of the armor that was made for the Khan. Good lord, man. Yeah. Use your ghost dance on him. What's a ghost dance? Do I have something called ghost dance? <laughs> okay. If you press right on the D-pad. You will call out all the remaining enemies and then just go stance all of them. Okay, cool. So I thought I had it down to just that one general. Ah, uh, blow the power cache and then fight the general. Gotcha. Uh, well, never mind. Yeah, go stance. Okay. You won the decapathon. Yeah, I lost the ghost dance. Oh, Hunter, I'm, I, you know me, man. I just kind of cut up like that. I don't actually go into the battle thinking I'm going to lose. Uh, you know, generally I have a fairly high level of confidence. Uh, it's just, you know, eh, comic relief, I guess, you know. Uh, just cutting up. Because then when I actually do die, <laughs> it's even that much funnier. Oh, uh, Jay says, please, Rex. Oh, no. No. I see your Schwartz is as big as mine. <laughs> yeah, don't stand there, all you Jeffs. Go do something. Yeah, Rex says, where's my tank? <laughs> For the honor of Grayskull. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, just a piece of the armor because we cut his fucking arm off. <laughs> okay, armor, cool. Oh yeah, look, we got a uh, what is that called? A uh, uh, the wrist guard thingy. Okay, can we stop with these standing around anime? Oh my god, another stand. I don't even know what that was. I'm just trying to stop standing there by the general. Technique point earned. New techniques. Oh. New techniques, huh? Wonder Woman bracelet? Yeah. Okay, 
these little these animations actually annoy me. I would really like to get out of this and go do more stuff. Can can I please get out of this? I'm whatever, man. Stand there and jerk off with your horse. I don't give a fuck. All right. Techniques. It said something about new. Was it telling me that new techniques are now available, or just that I have more points? You pet your damn horse. <laughs> I don't want to pet the damn horse. I get tired of standing there doing nothing. Okay, well, we have more skill points. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm down with some finding more resolve. That sounds cool. He deserves some loving. Yeah, I mean, I'd give him an apple or something if I had one. I just don't have one. And these are ways to find new charms. That actually, okay, yeah, thinking about that, that does actually sound fairly useful. Because it would be cool to acquire different charms and have more effects available. Available. Uh, what do we want to do? We're going to do another, uh, another Mongol camp? Should I do some story missions? I don't really know, like, what's coming up next in the game, so... Always use Jeff as a human shield. <laughs> Just more technique points, but you can spend them on exploration now. Yeah, okay. Cool. Charms before foxes, anything like bros before hoes. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh -huh. Just whatever's nearby. Okay, well, that's a good suggestion. Well, what is nearby? But, well, okay, there's a question mark right there. Let's go get it, cat. Shit, how do I get out of here now? Okay. Ah, good charm for mobs here, okay. Also, apologies to any actual Jeffs in the chat. <laughs> yes, very. <laughs> we should throw that disclaimer in there, shouldn't we? <laughs> yeah, Jeff the intern has our our ire. All the other Jeffs are cool. You guys are all right. <laughs> okay, I think I just missed that one. Is it weird that I'm better at jumping in first-person games? Third-person games, I don't do so well with the jumping. In them. I don't know why. Seems like To me, it seems like the perspective is off in third-person games. Especially if the field of view is dialed in really tight like it is in this game. It's much easier when the field of view is dialed out a bit. Okay, there we go. Alright. Chat time. Yeah, we're not roasting the real Jeffs. You guys are cool. Oh, so, Hunter, you're saying that charm that you're talking about synchronizes well with the Way of the Flame? Okay. Uh, I actually just unlocked Way of the Flame. I was thinking I should use Way of the Flame against this boss that I just dueled, and I, he was already dead by the time I remembered I had the skill. <laughs> yeah, James, it's a preview for Rex playing Uncharted. <laughs> yeah. And let's see what else do we have? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Only talking about Jeff the intern and your stepfather. <laughs> oh, oh, you can't use ghost weapons anyway. Uh, no, I was going to use the. Uh, what is that? 
Can you not use the flame, the flaming sword attack? It does count as a ghost weapon, I see. Okay, all right, well, <laughs> I probably would have died then if I had tried that. <laughs> Features around here we can climb on. Maybe. Yeah. Do we want to? Where are we actually going? Am I anywhere near it? <laughs> Fuck no. This. this looks like an enemy camp over here. Is this where I'm actually headed? Looks like that's where I'm headed. <laughs> yeah, Hunter, you're right, man. It's like the when you get the ability way of the flame, it's from a duel. <laughs> but you can't use it during a duel. <laughs> oh, well. High point guard post. Okay, well, let's go get them. I mean, it's on the way anyway, right? I think I am actually going to go for some uh, stealth gear. Uh, I mean, why not? Let's give it a shot, shall we? Dun, dun, dun. Now, which one is the better stealth gear? Uh, the Ronin attire or the ghost armor? I'm guessing the ghost armor, right? Ronin reduces enemy detection by 20%. Ghost reduces enemy detection speed by 40%. So that's a double right there. This is an increase to melee damage. This gets you back in ghost stance faster. That's right. And all kills have a 15% chance to terrify a nearby enemy. Well, that sounds like fun. Oh, it's really not that far. The map makes it look... Yeah, the map is kind of weird. Yeah, okay. You can use Heavenly Strike and Ghost Stance. <laughs> yes, dear. I'll try to remember that. Mm. Which both are unblockable. Now, it's interesting. You mentioned uh, Heavenly Strike. I tried to use Heavenly Strike, and that fucker blocked it. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if it was like a counter or something, but he did it twice. I tried to use Heavenly Strike, and he attacked while I was in the middle of it. And I tried to use it again, and he fucking kicked me while I was in the middle of it. So I don't know what's going on with that, but I did notice. I was like, hey, you just interrupted my badass power move. What the fuck? Uh, this bit looks like one of the Horde locations. <laughs> I was thinking it actually looked like just like rolling up on an ambush camp. Yeah, I was thinking ambush camp myself. Do you have the charm that doubles that percentage? It's a charm where anything with a chance to occur has twice the chance. I do not have that charm yet. I guess maybe that's something I need to do. Maybe look up some of the, like, the most powerful charms and go find them. Because I do not have that one. Ghost armor parried with a maxed out charm of silence. Best all-around stealth option. Okay, barring the DLC stuff. Okay. Gotta be faster, huh? I guess so. Uh, story of my life sometimes. Yeah, uh, what is the name of that charm? Um, okay, so charms. Yeah, let's look at what is it? How do we go to charms from here? Perfect parries are easy. No, wait, wait. I wanted to go. I did actually want to equip the ghost armor. That's that's what we were doing. Equip the ghost armor. Thank you. Um, mm -mm. Yeah, I can dig all of that. And then we're looking at charms. So for the ghost armor, I do need to equip different charms. And what's it called again? Charm of Fortune Level 2 is the one that makes stuff uh, doubles all chances. Do I? I don't think I have that. Okay, so for this stealth outfit, what do we want for the stealth outfit? I still like this one. I may stick with that. Lucky Charms. <laughs> well, they're magically delicious, aren't they? Uh, 
black powder bombs catch on fire and deal burn damage to other enemies. Well, that sounds like fun. That sounds fucking bomb right now. I know, right? Charm of Fortune 2. Okay, I'll see if I have it. Ooh, remain hidden when assassinating from the grass. I may put that in my second slot. Assassinated enemies drop additional ammo and supplies. I don't... I mean, that sounds cool, but I don't think I really need it, man. Okay, so I'm thinking... I'm thinking... Shit, what was I thinking? Remain hidden when assassinating. And also... There was... Uh, this one, Wind Chimes Release Poison. Yeah, I want to try those. Uh, <laughs> the Mongols are stealing me lucky charms! <laughs> God damn it. Uh, magically delicious. Charm of Fortune acquired by completing the side quest. Peace of the Divine. I don't know if I have that one. <laughs> Charm of Fortune sounds like a cool movie. Like straight to video. <laughs> Friends in passing. Interesting. Okay. Pompous grass is good. Oh, you've... Okay, yeah. I knew that sounded familiar. Yeah. I think I need to dedicate a little bit of time to finding uh, some of the... Like, you know, look up one of those videos. It's like, don't miss these items. You know, stuff like that. Um, okay, so we were looking to see if we have Charm of Fortune 2. I don't think I have that one. Nope. Nah, I do not have it. Ooh, static status effects last longer. That would be cool for like the uh, poison darts and the uh, hallucination darts. Yep, doing that. And then hidden sight, enemies stop hunting you faster. Yeah, I dig that one. I'm going to stick with that. Uh, Charm of Inari's Might. Hate typos. Yeah, friends in passing. Yeah, I thought that's what you meant. Oh, Chrissy's heading out. All right, y'all. Dinner's done. Got a skedaddle. <laughs> Happy to be back on a regular basis with all. Well, yes, ma'am. We're glad to have you back. Toyotama region is where you find that. Okay, is that... Ah, okay. So, hang on. I'll actually write that down one moment. <clears throat> okay, so for clarification, correct me if I'm wrong, the quest that we're talking about doing is a side mission called Friends in Passing. And that will give me the... Charm of Fortune 2, which is a really badass one. Did I get that right? Because that's what I have written in my little nerd notes here that I keep by my computer. So if I wrote it down wrong, it's your fault. Side quest in the Ishikawa region. Oh, okay. All right. So, what other charms are good for this build? For a like a stealth specific setup. Reduces enemy detection. Yeah, we're taking that one. Oh, well, if I if I already have this one, reduce enemy detection speed by 10. If I already have this, then I don't need this. Or do they stack? Do y'all know if they stack? The reduced enemy detection speed? That would be 25% if they stack. Four Ishikawa. That, okay, the archer. Oh, Oh, yeah, okay, I kind of wanted to do some more of his missions anyway. Yeah, right on. I already have one of those on, don't I? Charm of Fortune 2 that gives the occurrences with a percentage chance to occur an additional 50% of the time. That includes your armor augments. Okay. Uh, yeah, Knights of Felon, you might as well start streaming again, man. Yeah. And yes, they do stack. Interesting. I may stick with that one then, because I didn't really see anything else I really wanted. You know, specifically for this build. 
Yeah, fuck it. We'll, we'll stick with the ones that stack. Okay, let's go do some damage. We're hiding. I really haven't used these much. Let's do it. Oh. Well, don't come over here. Then I'll have to stab you. Ha 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 Yeah, go play with your friends. Hey, that's not pompous grass over there. I thought that was pompous grass over there. Ah, shit, I missed him. Dang it, Junior. Boy, I'll tell you what. Assholes. How's that for stealth, motherfucker? <laughs> Sir, don't come over here fucking with me. He sounds excited. No, Chris is like, okay, real quick, I saw that before shutting my laptop off, and you shot him right in the knee. <laughs> yeah. Fuck your knees, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, looks like this post blew up for some reason. I don't know. <laughs> also, I can spam your stream by writing in the group chat maybe a hijack come. Oh my. Uh oh. I'd do some deacon lines when you kill someone. <laughs> that would be funny. <laughs> Maybe I should just do the, what is it, the Tata Yori armor and do like a sniper build. Yeah, how you like that, huh? Someone shoots back. How's that feel? <laughs> okay, Chrissy's really out now. Bye. Fuck do you think you're going, sir? Or put that horn up. Asshole. Oh, so he's got a horn too. Fine. Ooh, I want to poison this dude. Oh, he's running. Stop running. I wanted to poison you. is pompous grass over there. Time to push up. He's facing that way. Okay. Moving up. Oh, there's got to be an archer up on the tower. Gotcha. Okay. Archer in the tower. That's clear. Okay. Oh, there are multiple archers up there. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, that could be interesting. 
Can I maybe get to the top and like pop smoke or something? Maybe that'll work if I can't just get up there and do a quiet chain assassinate. This guy. Oh, I'm going to shank him as he walks past this grass. Maybe. What? Sir? You're <laughs> right in the junk. That ought to piss him off. actually mess around with stealth a bit more in this game. That actually was fun. Especially now that I've unlocked more of the tools that make stealth doable. Aw, uh, yeah. I may actually have to mess around with this some more. That was fun. Oh, more loot. Okay, let me catch up with the chat now that we're done with this camp. <clears throat> Oh, Jay, you're saying the uh, the Tadayori armor is a good build? Fully maxed out draw and knocking speed? Ooh, that does sound nice, actually. Yeah, Hunter, you're good with the Tadayori armor build as well? <laughs> Danger zone! <laughs> Dandy Denny, why are you laughing? What's so funny, ma'am? <laughs> Residue bolt for the heavy strategy? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Really. We got more loot? I do like loot. Rather fond of loot. And arrows. Arrows are cool, too. They have their uses. Did I pass it? I hear a golden bird as well. I'll have to go see what he's up to. And we have, uh, I think I've got enough uh, supplies and stuff for some uh, upgrades. A couple of different upgrades. Want to look into that soon also. Oh, wait, 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 wait. They had stuff. They had loot. Loot, loot. More loot. Okay, what does this golden bird want? I hear him. I have lost sight of him. Sir, you know I can't climb that, right? Oh, hello. This bird wants me to climb stuff I can't climb. Wants me to jump off of stuff I can't survive jumping off of. Peasant coffin. Door barricaded. Open the door. My name is Jin Sakai. The ghost! You poisoned us. Isn't that enough? I did no I, such thing. I didn't poison you. you did I mean, I will, castle. but I didn't. How you killed all those people? They were Mongols. I would never Whatever harm you. Whatever you could. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Huh. Rex appreciating the crossbow. 
I never said that. Don't put words in my mouth. Rex considering stealth. Maybe Claire really does have the real Rex in her dungeon, I mean basement, and this is just a damn good impersonator. <laughs> Now, Jay says using the firecrackers and the bell chimes will help a lot, but Richie says don't go stealth on me. <laughs> no. Making a scene is all we got left in this world, and sometimes. This Rex is actually Claire. Mm, no, Claire is actually way better at stealth than I am. <laughs> With a voice synthesizer to sound like Rex. <laughs> Rex test. Whataburger or In and Out? Uh, Carl's Jr. <laughs> that follows. We'll never let you in. You'll die without medicine and food. I'll bring it. Mm. <laughs> Pasta. <laughs> Should be a camp up the mountain. Might have what they need. This way. No, up. It did not just come from there. God damn it. Dang it, Junior. Boy, I'll tell you what. I literally just climbed down from here. Can't go that way, can we? How far are we going with this? 80 meters? Okay, that's not that far. An even better Rex test. <laughs> now, wait a minute. Well, I was just up here, wasn't I? Is this not the camp I just cleared? It is. No one here. Maybe out hunting. Oh, damn, I'm glad I came back here, though. There was a lot of loot up here. Shit. Clean car or trash panda on wheels? <laughs> Medicine should stop the poison. Clean car. <laughs> yeah, now you know it's really me. <clears throat> Virtually spotless, shiny black and chrome car. <laughs> yes, it's definitely me. I am a keep your ride clean kind of guy. Food will give those people strength. Yeah, Claire would know that too, yeah? She's seen the inside of my car. Good. Get all this back to the cabin. Smoke. Oh, wait, what? Maybe they're cooking me dinner? Mongo's burning the cabin. You assholes. Oh, yeah, I, I would like to do a standoff this time, actually. Oh, damn, there's a bunch of them. Oh, look, they've got the bodies hung outside. Oh, you fucking dicks. Oh, yeah, okay, we're not stealthing this one. We are just kicking some ass this time. That's the one. <laughs> Shot me right out of the fucking air. Asshole. Oh, okay, yeah. More of this, less of the dying. More of the killing, less of the dying. Flaming sword. Oh, 
<clears throat> That's what y'all get for burning down peasant huts. Okay, catch up with the chat. <clears throat> yep, it's me. But yeah, Claire would know that too. She's seen the inside of my car. <laughs> Dang it, Junior. Boy, I tell you what. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty convincing, ain't it? <laughs> you either clean it like a serial killer or you don't. <laughs> Oh, Days Gone Podcast. Um, hey, what did I miss? Uh, they were trying to figure out, since I was talking about doing stealth or, uh, yeah, taking on stealth and actually using, uh, like, uh, hallucination darts and stuff. They were like, wait, is that really Rex or is that Claire? Did Claire take his controller again? No, it's really me. Another one of those unfortunate missions, yeah. Uh, see, Kat says, we got a new car. Asked the hubby what we bought. All I knew was it's blue and it has four wheels. <laughs> uh, yeah, nothing to see here, Claire. Nothing to see. <laughs> Just chilling and eating pasta. Nothing crazy. <laughs> Okay, and what else do we got? <clears throat> this is my rifle. There are many other there are many others like it, but this one is mine. Without my rifle, I am useless. Uh okay, speak to the woman. This game is fucking brutal, dude. No one can help me now. I'm sorry. What about the others? <laughs> They're all dead. It was the Mongols. <sighs> and when we didn't die, they came with fire. If I'd let you in before... So, Kat, that new car, uh, <clears throat> does your husband keep it clean, at least? You may not know what it is, but is it at least clean? We survive if we don't trust each other? It was the mongrels, so... <laughs> Yeah, this is my bow. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Without me, my bow is useless. Without my bow, I am useless. Okay, well that was a... I mean, that was fairly easy. Fairly quick little side mission there. Now let's pull a Geralt of Rivia and see if these peasants had any loot worth taking. <laughs> nope, guess not. Oh well. Bummer. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else do we have going? <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Let's go do some more Mongol camps, man. That, that's actually fun. I enjoy doing that. Man, that shit's a long way.
Oh yeah, the dog's getting jealous of it. She's meant to be his one and only princess. <laughs> well, I mean, you gotta respect a guy that keeps his car clean. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, no, Claire does not have me locked up in her dungeon right now. She has seen the inside of my car, though, and she may or may not have been blindfolded for part of that ride. Hey, are they going to kill that hog? I guess I'll have to. Predator hides. Needed that. <laughs> You've seen the inside of my car, but you didn't see much. <laughs> <laughs> Super sus. <laughs> I guess we can go back to a stealth build. I was actually enjoying that. <clears throat> was wearing a helmet. Damage enemies with an explosive arrow three times. Okay. So what do you get when you complete the objectives in this game? Uh, stuff like that. Do you just get like extra supplies or something when you're done or, or what? <laughs> hmm. More XP towards your next technique point. Okay. <laughs> In the trunk? No. Tied up in the back seat? Maybe. Like, only one dude even noticed that I just killed their leader. <laughs> He's burning off. <laughs> Later, fuckers. I'm out. <laughs> I can't say I blame him. What? Yeah, put your fucking horn down and shut your mouth. Asshole. What'd you call me? Really? Uh, sure, call more. I need to damage you with an arrow anyway. Damn 
damage enemies with an explosive arrow. Oh, okay, so I can just do... There's two of them. And there's a few more. Oh shit, there's still an archer up there. That's a problem. I love that attack. Let's catch up with the chat. <clears throat> ah, legend increase and... Uh, okay. <laughs> in the boot of the car. <laughs> Junk in the trunk, loot in the boot. <laughs> Off with their head. Oh, God. Finn just ran through the house butt-ass naked, yelling, Free Willy! <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh, fucking kids, man. <laughs> so there goes Jeff on another coffee run. <laughs> Did you send him for coffee? No. Did you? Aw, oh, fuck. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Free Willy. Oh, my good lord. <laughs> Looks like Rex was one step ahead. <laughs> you could use a glow up. Boom! Bull rush. Yeah, I love that shoulder slam ability in this game and in uh, Days Gone. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, what else? What else have we got going on? Chet, have we got time to do another camp? We might have time to do another camp. Or at least run around and clear this one of loot. Let's check inside these dwellings. Hang on a sec, folks. My kiddo is messaging me. Let me see what she needs. <laughs> uh, it's just sending me funny memes. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> Hides. I bet I do need a few more arrows, don't I? Yeah. Let's get in out of the cold for a moment. <laughs> Hang on a second, folks. I gotta respond to this. Stabby stabby time! Let's get all slicey and play with knives and stuff. <gasps> yeah. 
So I find it interesting that killing or causing that one enemy to flee actually counts as getting a kill in the camp. Because I mean, or did he come back and I had to kill him? I don't, I don't remember seeing him come back into the camp. I guess once he ran off, that actually counted as, uh, you know, clearing the camp of that enemy. <laughs> Days Gone Podcast, you would pop in when somebody mentions stabbing or playing with knives. <laughs> you are such a stabby little thing. <laughs> snickety snickety, right? <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Stabby little thing. Stab at the crystal. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Sir, I'm going to have to put you in timeout. <laughs> oh, that's a good one, man. That's, that's actually funny as fuck. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, oh, he just popped out for cigarettes. He'll be back any day, yeah. Mm. <laughs> oh, hey, here's some buttholes. Now, these... I wonder... I should probably do a standoff against these guys that are out in the open, right? Rather than trying to stealth all of them. Or, no, I know. Maybe I'll find a heavy and use a hallucination dart. What the fuck are you... Boy, what are you doing? Hi, hi, hi. Let me fuck in with the hostages, man. What's wrong with you, boy? Didn't your daddy teach you any manners? Damn. Some people's kids. I do like to get them clustered up and then explode them. <laughs> Group bonfire. Fucking horn up, sir. Okay, are we done? I think we're done. Let's go now. I need your help. Yeah, you do. You're going to be all right. My prayers have been answered. Go. Be well. I'd be honored if you had this. Oh, well, Knights of Finland, you heading out? All right, man, take it easy. We will see you next time. Oh, you thought I had decided to murder the horse? No, no, no. Horses are cool. You guys drop any loot? Hmm, I do have a question for the chat. Um, uh, folks who are more experienced with this game... Is there a reliable location to find the poison for the hallucination darts? Because, like, I stumble across it in the wild every now and then, but I don't know where to actually, like, like I want to get some, I need to go here. Um, so where are some good spots to pick up the plants for the hallucination darts? See, this is this is this is our location. This is where we're headed. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I won't murder the horses, but I don't really dig petting them either. 
Mm, yeah, Kat, I, I, uh, are you talking about the hallucination darts? I do have the recipe. I just I don't know where to go to always find more of the plant for them. The herb. I'm having trouble finding herb, man. Can anybody help me out? <laughs> You have arrived at your destination. Um, let's see. Jay says, really just big fields and maybe mountainsides. Okay, interesting. <laughs> no, Richie, she's not a she's not a Beatles fan, man. <laughs> Think they grow along lakes and streams. No, that's lavender. <laughs> man, you trying to get me jumped by a horde? <laughs> Uh, you tend to see a lot of them in the cushy grass. Okay. Where's Wade when you need him? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Wade can find you some herb. Okay. Well, that was pure fucking luck. Okay, we have to rescue hostages four times, and we need to assassinate an enemy from above. Death from above! <laughs> yeah, that's why we're here, right, Dandy? <clears throat> Hang out, have a good time, have a good laugh. Yeah, I know, right? Death Train Horde flashbacks intensify. That's okay. For me, that's the part when the heavy metal intensifies. It's like when you get into a boss battle in Doom. Sir, you would turn around right as I was trying to close the distance on you. Just for that, I'm going to shank your ass in the ear. Fuck you in your ear hole. With something sharp and stabby. Oh, fuck, there's assholes up here, too. Okay. Alrighty, then. Oh. Inside the structure? Looks like it. At least three upstairs. Oh, interesting. Can I get to him? Oh, hello. Coming to catch you. Now what? <gasps> Stabby Road, yeah. Westminster Stabby. Oh, you killed the Cyber Demon in Doom 2016 recently. Fuck yeah, man. How was that for an intense boss battle where heavy metal intensifies? Not a fan of the Beatles, huh? Yeah, nothing wrong with that. Downtown Stabby. You guys are fucking nuts. Climb up on the roof. That's a good idea. My throat. I'm not supposed to get knives in it. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Bolton Stabby. It's near where she grew up. Bolton Stabby. Sounds cool. Let's go check it out sometime. Up on, ah, cat, that is a brilliant idea, ma'am. Good idea. We'll jump up on the roof, work our way in, if we can, uh, work our way in and then, you know, uh, move in and work our way down. That's what I mean to say. Ah, yes. Okay, well, this dude's turn. No, but we can get him with a, what do they, what do they call those? A shoji assassination? No, he's not close enough to the door now. Damn. Can I get this asshole? He's. Yeah, let's get him. Hey, buddy. Nope, nobody here. 
Don't know what you're talking about. God dang it. Bye. Later, bitches. Oh, no, there's a hostage in there. Oh, fuck. Yeah, we, I, I gotta go get him. Gotta go get him. Come on. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, fuck. That one hurt. All right. What, sir? I told... I hit triangle for chain assassinate. Yes. Oh. Yeah, not today. That everybody? All right, yeah, screw you guys. Okay. <laughs> That's what happens when I try to do stealth, man. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's see. Oh, okay. Would your favorite art style be ab abstat off? <laughs> Bolton Abbey in North Yorkshire. Okay. Caltrops and other things. Never mind. Kunai. Or that. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, we, we managed to save the uh, hostage, so I like I safe. good job, I be guess. Careful. Stab it in Costello. God damn it. <laughs> oh, smoke is your favorite in Legends. I've never tried it in Legends. Next station is... <clears throat> the next station is Cockstabber Station. Change here for the Piccadilly line. No, that doesn't really work. But I'm going to leave it here anyway. Yeah, why not? Oh, look at Rex remembering his throwy things. <laughs> Excellent, Rex. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I pay attention. To some things. Oh, yeah. Oh, I see. Oh. Now, didn't we discuss a while back if you use... Oh, shit, I'm out of hallucination darts. Okay, Right. Uh, didn't we discuss a while back if you use hallucination darts, sometimes they will kill the hostage? I don't recall exactly now, but that's what I was thinking. Hey, BOP. Yeah, man, we're still here well, for a little bit. Yeah, I think we'll at least try to finish clearing this camp. Stealing your supplies and you can't see me. Hear you, huh? Days Gone podcast says gonna dip out for a bit again. Actually, going to do <laughs> actually going to do some packing this time. Lord All right, Sakai, go, be well. Well, good luck with that, dear. Need the way off the yeah, James. Good luck on your move as well. Kunai are full. Okay, more hostages to rescue. All right, got it. Right this way then. Mm, okay. Well, that's kind of a exposed position there, right out there in the open. I'll have to take out this guy and under me. Probably that dude over there. That dude over there. And then those two. Okay, let's, can I get in after... I'm going to get spotted if I drop down here on time. Uh, he's moving over this way now. All right, come to get you. What? Oh, oh dude! 
That's fucking bullshit. Let's go get the hostage. No, you don't. I was just looking for you. <laughs> And charm with the wind chimes. I I'm fucking forgot. I have that one. Yeah. yeah. Shit. <sighs> okay. Oh my. Wait, what are we talking about? I'm not I'm not stabbing any roosters. Wait, I don't I don't hurt roosters. I mean I'll choke them every now and then, but that's different. Firecrackers to bunch them up for a chain kill. Uh -huh, uh huh. Firecrackers. Group them up with firecrackers. And don't forget the poison wind charms. Wind chimes. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. And one more hostage. Okay, so let's take a look at that. The, uh,. Wind chimes are here. Firecrackers are here. Got it. What is this one again? I don't think I've ever used one of these. The black powder bombs. Wind chimes, firecrackers, black powder bomb. Okay, got it. <laughs> is that a euphemism? <laughs> Holes left over here. Damn. Can we get all the way up on the top here? Oh, sir. Damn. Okay. That's a lot of assholes. Quit fucking around and go kill this dude. Thank you. <clears throat> New segment, Rexting After Dark. <laughs> Black powder bombs are basically grenades. Okay. Multiple enemies in a radius, including you, if you're not careful. Okay. Uh, to borrow a Rex phrase, we are covered in assholes out here. <laughs> Bombs away, draw them away. Yeah. I think I like the idea of maybe using uh, what the firecracker to group them up and then using a black powder bomb. That sounds, that sounds like a very days gone tactic, doesn't it? Using a tractor to group them up and then toss a grenade in there. Ooh, I bet it will hurt the hostages, too, though, so I'll have to be careful with that. James, you heading out? Got to hit the hay. All right, man. I'll be seeing y'all from my new place next time. All right, buddy. Well, good luck with the move, man. Take it easy. <laughs> Rexting while driving will get you wrecked. <laughs> Against the law in several states, right? 
Okay, what do we have? Dog way over there. Two dogs. Hey, two dog. He's at the sawmill, right? There's one in there. Anybody? And there is someone in this structure below me. Okay. Can I get inside this structure? Sir, get down off of the fucking pole. Oh shit, I need to heal. Why didn't y'all tell me I needed to heal, man? It will not hurt the hostage, okay. I remember the first time I did the two dog mission, the sawmill horde tore that dude apart. Yeah, they did. <laughs> and the first time I did the two dog mission, um, I, of course, I wound up having to chase him into the horde the first time I did it. But after that, I was like, nah, man, there's got to be a better way to do this. Uh, so that was when I, I ran the mission again and watched where his spawn point was, the way he spawns in on top of that Nero building up there. So what did I do? I went in before the mission, planted two proximity mines up there, and he spawns in right on top of them. I have that video on my YouTube channel if you'd like to watch it sometime. All right, now weren't we just talking about firecrackers to gather them up and black powder bombs to pop them? If they'll go for it, they're all ignoring the firecrackers. Right? <sighs> Well, that was a waste of firecrackers. Yep, sir, just climb the fucking roof, please. Thank you. Hmm. All right. I think we'll try that again, but a little bit different. Where did they all go? Where the fuck are they? Oh, okay, well, there's two right there. Eh, fuck it, why not? It didn't kill him though, did it? They're just like staggered or something. Yeah, whatever, dude. Yeah, 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 we're good. Hmm. Can't shoot the bow from the side of the leaf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Working on it. No predator hides? I actually do need more predator hides. There we go. Alright. Hey, buddy. How you doing? You'll be free <clears> soon. <throat> you don't need no stinking Thank healing. You saving us, my lord. <laughs> Oh, the two dog mission is one of the few missions that bugged for you. Interesting. Okay. You're right. This was meant for Oh, Dandy Denny, you used my method uh, using the proximity mines? <laughs> nice. Love it. Just a guy on a bike who I followed to a house where he ran into a wall and got stuck. <laughs> oh, another piece of the Mongolian armor. Okay, cool. That ha ha sounded just almost exactly like Wario. 
Yes, battery controller getting low. Did that pop up on screen for y'all? Okay, well, I guess that means it's about time to shut it down anyway. Oh, oh, it's like a, what, a pauldron? Shoulder pieces? Neat. The monks say this suffering is Oh, uh, what the f Oh, he's gonna do the standing around thing. Yep, okay. Okay, gotcha. Alright, cool, man. Bonus objective completed. Increased legend. Legendary. I thought we were about to blow up one of those explosive carts. It's like, wait, why am I in here blowing this up? There's people. Oh, never mind. <laughs> uh. Okay. <clears throat> All right, folks. Well, I have had an absolute fucking blast. Uh, it's actually been kind of a bad day. I mean, only a little. I fucked up earlier. I'm working on a project for the uh, the Days Gone anniversary, which is coming up. The three-year anniversary of Days Gone is going to be Tuesday, the 26th. And I've been working on a project, a new video I want to put out uh, for the anniversary. And today I fucked up and deleted about 50% of the master files for the project I'm working on. So I'm going to have to go back and redo about 50% of it. Uh, so I was actually a little upset, pretty fucking frustrated earlier, actually. I mean, I have a better idea of what I want to do now, and like I've kind of, I've got my rhythm down, you know, so it'll be a little bit easier to reproduce those uh, initial videos. But yeah, I'm going to have to redo a shitload of work on it. So that pretty much gives me tomorrow and the next day to finish up a project I've been working on for a couple of weeks. Uh, but anyway, it's all good. I still had a good time, uh, you know. Managed to get back in my groove and have a good time with this game tonight. So, I think we're going to shut it down, man. Uh, but first, a message from our sponsors, or something, I don't know. Um, I'd like to give a shout out to Basics of Pain. I know he likes to remain low-key when he does those Super Chat contributions, but hey, brother, I really appreciate it. Uh, had to go ahead and throw it out there anyway. I uh, appreciate all of my Super Chat supporters, my Patreon supporters. You guys, should, you make it happen, man. Um, what do we have going on? What the fuck is today? Saturday? Okay, so tomorrow, Claire, on the Days Gone podcast channel, will be doing a Demon Slay Sunday. I believe she's doing that at 6 p.m. Central Time. Um, uh, no, wait, I said that wrong. A specific time. Mine is Central Time. Hers is uh, Pacific. So, like, 6 p.m. Pacific. Um, if I have that right. She'll probably have it on some of her social media, just for clarification. I think she mentioned it in her stream this morning as well, or yesterday, rather. Um, anyway, I'm going to get out of here before I say something else dumb. Uh, Tuesday is the uh, three-year anniversary of Days Gone. Uh, pretty much everybody I know that makes Days Gone content has got something planned for that day, myself. Miss Claire, myself, and Claire for the Tuesday Night Feedback Loop live stream, and Borislav 24 7 has got a little something he's working on too. So, everybody be ready for Tuesday. There's going to be a shitload of new Days Gone content. Love you guys. I'm going to get the fuck out of here. Good night.